How to connect a Namecheap domain to Shopify. This video is going to be a complete tutorial. So if you follow along by the end of this video, you will be able to connect your Namecheap domain to Shopify. Now, the first thing that we are going to do is actually buy the domain. If you already have your domain and you just need to connect it, you can skip to the timestamp shown on screen now. However, if you do not yet have your domain, what you want to do is click on the first link down in the description and you can get almost half price on your Namecheap domain. So once you have opened up that link, it's going to take you over to this page right here. And then all we are going to do is enter in the domain that you would like to buy for your store. So I'm just going to type in GeForce North 123 we can then click on search and then all of the domains are going to get brought up. You can see all of the domains down here. We have .io, .pro, .info, but more importantly, at the top, we have .com. Now, if your domain is not available with the .com right here, you can go to the generator and use the generator to actually create you a new name. You can enter in keywords related to your brand. If I was going for a blender, I could go ahead and enter that in, move the price way down and then click generate. And then as you can see, it's going to create us a bunch of brand names. Either way though, we want to find the domain and then what we can do is click add to cart. Right here is a discount code. So we want to go ahead and copy this, then go over to the checkout and you are going to get brought over to the screen where we can go ahead and check out. There is one super important thing that we need to do here. And that is we need to scroll down and right here where it says SSL, we need to go ahead and add this. The reason that we also need to purchase SSL is SSL is this padlock that you see in the top corner of any website that you go to. The reason that we need this is if you do not have this SSL certificate, when people try to access your website, they will be shown an error and it will effectively say this website is not secure and it could be a scam. I will put a screenshot on screen now of what that will look like. So super important that we get this SSL certificate. We can then go ahead and enter in the promo, click apply and then confirm the order. From here, we just click on pay now and then you can go through and buy your Namecheap domain. Once you have your domain, we just want to then go over to Shopify and on Shopify, click on the settings icon in the bottom left corner. That is then going to load up the Shopify settings. And from here, we just want to go down to domains. So click on domains right here. And this is going to take you over to domains. From this option, just click on connect existing domain here at the top. So just enter in your domain right here and click on next. It's then going to take us over to this page. So go ahead and click on this button that says verify connection. It's then going to bring us over to here where we have these values for the A record and C name. Once you see these records on your screen, we can then go back over to Namecheap. And if you are not already, you want to go over to the Namecheap dashboard. To do this, just go to account right here, click on dashboard, and that will take you over to this dashboard. Next, you want to scroll down and find the domain that you would like to connect. I'm going to go for this one. And then once you have found your domain, click on manage on this right hand side. It's then going to take us into the domain menu. And from here, click on advanced DNS. You may have some records already in here. So just go ahead and delete these just like I am right now. And make sure that we have no records in here. Once all of your records have been cleared, click here to add a new record. And then if we go back over to Shopify, we can see that the first thing we need to add is an A record. So from this drop down menu, click on A record. Then in host, this is this at symbol. So we can copy this and then paste this into host. Next, we need the value. So we can go back over to Shopify and then we can see the required value is right here. So we can click on copy go back over to Namecheap and then paste it in here. Once all of that is done, leave this to automatic and click on this check mark icon. We then want to add in a new record. So click add record. 
Then we need to add a C name for the second one. So from this drop down menu, go for C name. If we look, the host now is www. So we paste that in the host. And then the target is this one right here, the required value. So we copy and paste that into there. Once again, click the check mark. And now we are done. So from here, all we need to do is go over to Shopify. At the bottom here, click on verify connection. And then as you can see, that has now been added. It may say SSL pending, this can take up to 24 hours. So just wait. And that is how you can connect your Shopify store to your Namecheap domain.